Lisa oh said God, she's so been funny. shocked by a lot of her son's choices from his fudge college days to his decision to get frosted tips. Tonight, we're going to see which real housewife happenings have left Danny shook. It's time for Bravo. No, they didn't. Salt Lake City, what did you think of Monica's sit down with the mom tonight? I mean, I think they have a lot of problems that maybe they shouldn't be dealing with on camera, but I'm happy that they are. Do you yeah. agree with Whitney <laughs> that there's a pattern of Meredith seemingly bringing up info on all the ladies? Might be a bad answer, but agree again, I think yes. Uh, that is a pattern of Meredith's, but I also enjoy that as well. So. Um, which of Lisa's meltdowns this season did you find to be more justified, losing her ring or not wanting to give up her glam? The glam, because I don't love a costume party. I know we're here on Halloween. Yes. Happy Halloween. But I got it. I understood Lisa Danny gets not me. wanting to do that. <laughs> but by the way, that Trixie Motel trip was one of the best vacations in Bravo history, I think. Everyone should go to that motel. It's um, every housewife yeah. should What's go to that been your favorite Miriam Cosby moment from this season? so far. I mean, it's her sitting down with Robert and finding out whether or not he was married was <laughs> incredible, but also just her look um, when the bunny came to her car and then ultimately she couldn't make it to the Easter party because of course her Las Vegas house was flooded a year ago. So that was right. <laughs> um, what did you make of Kyle and Mauricio's awkward conversation at the end of the Beverly Hills premiere? The first time I sort of felt like it was a real situation. I thought a lot of it was playing to the press and stuff with the rings and the all the stuff that was going on that they have been and photograph without rings and uh, so it was the first time I really believed what was happening with the two of them. Were you surprised that Dorit admitted to issues in her marriage with PK? Yeah, I was surprised about it, but I was happy Dorit was opening up. I do feel like a spark has been missing from Dorit since the first time she was on the show and I don't know what that's attributed to. It just feels like a little spark is missing. Uh, what advice do you have for Erica on how to get empathy for others? I don't know if Erica's in the business of getting advice on empathy, but if she, <laughs> but if she was, I'd say do it. <laughs> what was your reaction to Uba being so upset at the reunion? You know, I loved Uba. I felt like Uba really came alive the second half of The Real Houses of New York. I was excited about it. Uh, favorite Jesselism from this season of Roni? Oh, gosh. I mean, the Tribeca stuff. Oh, I also, uh, when during the reunion, when Jessel said Judith Bloom, she was like, right. and you said, is her name Judith? She's like, probably. <laughs> um, Orange County, was this season? Season, current season, a pileup on Heather Dubrow. It was, but I thought Heather handled it masterfully, and I think actually Heather liked it because Heather was seemed engaged uh, in the show in a, in a great way, so I think it was, but I think Heather probably liked having someone to spar with. Reaction to everything Ryan, especially his denim jacket. Hey Dennis. Tough. <laughs> it's tough. Uh, but one weird thing about Ryan, or one great thing about Ryan is I felt like he took everything with a smile. And by the end of the season, I was thinking, like, he took a lot of crap. He deserved it. He seems like probably a demon. On a scale of <laughs> 1 to 10, how did you rate Tamara's return? I thought Tamara's return was great. It was a little messy, but I think that also made the rest of the cast kind of rise to her level in a way. So I think it was, like, totally successful. And I think she was maybe off her game a little bit from her time off, but I thought it was so successful. Yeah. Thank you, Dan. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.